So one of the common questions that CCT has asked is what is the difference between plenum and non-plenum rated cables? Non-plenum rated cables simply mean that they are used in, in environments that don't have high temperature ratings. The main reason that you will use plenum is mainly just for temperature rating. Not only will it allow and in stay intact at higher temperatures, but also the burn rate is much slower. So while a CMR cable may burn faster, a plenum rated cable will emit less smoke and not have as much burn rate. If you look at your non-plenum rating, a lot of classifications of the rating that you'll see is CMR, FPLR, anything that went with an R in order to signify a riser rated application. On plenum, it has that P. So now you have CMP, FPLP, and that P then designates a plenum rated application. The reason that you would use plenum versus non-plenum is again, not only in higher temperature rating, but plenum cables are normally used in airspace or up walls. And basically when you don't want the signal or the fire to travel from floor to floor, you would want to use a plenum cable because the plenum compound will smolder. It will never actually catch fire. Whereas the riser rated compound will never actually catch fire, but it has a much higher rate and a much more smoldering effect than any kind of plenum cable would. The application of the cable you're using is, it will determine what rating you need. If you need a higher temperature rating, you will obviously use the plenum. If the plenum rating is not as important, then you can use a riser application. In most municipalities, hospitals, schools, and anything of the nature where you are concerned of the, of the higher temperature rating, you would want to use a plenum because this will allow you to have better temperature controls and more time to allow the cable to perform its duties before an emergency occurs. Currently, right now, there are higher temperature rating compounds out there in addition to plenum, the most common being plenum. If you need a higher rating, you can go to a low smoke zero halogen compound or LSZH compound, as well as just a straight FEP, FEP combination. Those will allow you to have a much higher temperature rated cable and allow you to achieve temperature ratings of 200 degrees, as opposed to where some of your plenum applications are closer to 75 degrees Celsius or 100 degrees Celsius. By having a plenum rated cable and the higher temperature rating, this will then keep that cable performing as long as possible. By having that cable as long as possible, it provides more time for people to evacuate a building if that is in nature. It allows the system, the cable to perform if its notification, its main purpose is to notify the authorities that there is an emergency. So those are the main reasons why you would want to use the higher temperature rating or plenum rated cable.